So I've got a little movie here for you. Taking off from Culpeper Airport, headed back to Manassas, and crossing the Rappahannock there. Made this little movie by importing all the track data I recorded on the tablet on this flight, and then importing into Google Earth, crossing 29 there. Headed toward Warrington Airport, and I uh, can't quite get in because he uh, hasn't seen my transponder yet, so I got to do this little circling maneuver. And right about as I get right around here, he says, Okay. So it gives me the magic words, and away I go straight for Manassas. Got the railroad tracks there on my left, crossing Warrington Airport about 3,000 feet or so, just ducking under the Class B. Headed back for Manassas. Can't see it. It's out there on the horizon. But I'm scooting across the ground here about six times real time. So I'm doing probably about 800 miles an hour. Making good time headed for my left base for 3-4 right. We've heard those words a hundred times. And right around here I start to uh, square up my left base. Here it is right there. And the controller says uh, it's got some spacing issues. It asked me to do a right 270 to make some room, which I do. And so I cross a little creek here. And a little glitch when I cross the creek. I think Google Earth is doing something funny with the altitude data with respect to the terrain or something. And I come right here and cross that creek again. Another little glitch. But I'm on final now, headed for 3 4 right. And look at there, the track is running right down the runway just like it's supposed to. If you look real close, I make this first turn off there right on the taxiway. Love it when a plan comes together.